Okay, so I'm inside the tent, the bee tent, and I've got, I got them smoked down, but as you can, well, you may or may not see, but we're inside the tent, and I hope this is showing up, but there's, you know, bees everywhere. Got them smoked down, and I'm just about to give them their uh, final feeding for the winter so that they can uh, get ready to start making honey for me to sell at the market. Let me get this set up. Now I'm only going to film one, me uh, filling one uh, of the hives feeders because uh, I don't want to make the video long, too long. Um, but and I'd be using my uh, smartphone for this, but I'm currently using that to upload a video to YouTube because my computer uh, is have, going through a little bit of operating system problems at the moment. So I guess I'm going to be using this video that I'm making now to test to see if I can upload a video with my computer without it freezing up or restarting itself. Okay. So just filling these up. Actually, I think this is the first time I've ever filmed my bees. I hope they're not camera shy. Rocks back in there so they don't drown. And that's one of three down. I've also got uh, some brood builder powder so I can mix some of the uh, sugar syrup into uh, one of those but I put that in there way too um, uh, way too early in the winter I'll probably keep this video like five minutes. Uh, go on. Get back in there. Get, yeah, there you go. Let's see how it is now. It's three minutes and... Three and a half minutes so far. But yeah, uh, I'll be making another video probably with my smartphone. Um, when I get the, the bees set back up. Uh, for production which is, will be in about a day or two now you probably won't be seeing that video for a few days further than that because it takes like a day or more to upload videos especially if they're long like 15 20 minutes I guess the connections are just horrible out here or maybe that's just YouTube I don't know but anyway um, the tent has worked very well despite the fact that the winter has been pretty much of a giant pussy this year um, so but you know that's a good thing um, both hives are alive this one's doing a lot better because it had uh, more I don't know if you can see the entrance there and this one is not as big but it's still alive and kicking yeah you can see them there <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I'm probably going to uh, cut this video short at five minutes uh, or so. Um, and when I get them set up, this tent, I'll take this tent down. Um, I'll probably leave the styrofoam on there just in case. But it has been really warm. Plus they got feed and they're already 
they're already pulling in uh, pollen from somewhere, wherever the hell that is. It's late January. I think it's January 20th, 21st, something like that. Um, and I'm wearing a t-shirt and shorts. So, yeah, it, it, it's shaping up to be a really good year so far. Uh, and I'm hoping to get at least two harvests out of this, possibly one split. This I still got all the components. This is the, uh, basically a collapsed hive uh, that died one winter. Um, I think year before last. But yeah, it, uh, it it's shaping up really good. I just need to get some frames, and I'll be all set. So uh, I, I will see you in the next video. Uh, which will be me setting up my bees for uh, for production.